Chapter 6 The sons of Levi were Gershon, Kohath, and Morarai. The descendants of Kohath included Amram, Izhar, Hebron, and Uziel. The children of Amram were Aaron, Moses, and Miriam. The sons of Aaron were Nadab, Abihu, Eleazar, and Ithamar. Eleazar was the father of Phinehas. Phinehas was the father of Abishua. Abishua was the father of Bukai. Bukai was the father of Uzai. Uzai was the father of Zerahiah. Zerahiah was the father of Meraioth. Meraioth was the father of Amariah. Amariah was the father of Ahitub. Ahitub was the father of Zadok. Zadok was the father of Ahimaaz. Ahimaaz was the father of Azariah. Azariah was the father of Johanan. Johanan was the father of Azariah, the high priest of the temple built by Solomon in Jerusalem. Azariah was the father of Amariah. Amariah was the father of Ahitub. Ahitub was the father of Zadok. Zadok was the father of Shalom. Shalom was the father of Hilkiah. Hilkiah was the father of Azariah. Azariah was the father of Seraiah. Seraiah was the father of Jehozadak, who went into exile when the Lord sent the people of Judah and Jerusalem into captivity under Nebuchadnezzar. The sons of Levi were Gershon, Kohath, and Marari. The descendants of Gershon included Libni and Shimei. The descendants of Kohath included Amram, Izhar, Hebron, and Uziel. The descendants of Marari included Malai and Mushai. The following were the Levite clans listed according to their ancestral descent. The descendants of Gershon included Libni, Jechath, Zima, Joah, Aido, Zira, and Jeatherai. The descendants of Kohath included Aminadab, Korah, Asir, Elkenah, Abiasaf, Asir, Tehath, Uriel, Uzziah, and Shaul. The descendants of Elkenah included Amesai, Ahimoth, Elkenah, Zophai, Nechath, Eliab, Jeroham, Elkanah, and Samuel. The sons of Samuel were Joel, the older, and Abijah, the second. The descendants of Marari included Malai, Libni, Shimei, Uzzah, Shimei, Haggai, and Azaiah. David assigned the following men to lead the music at the house of the Lord after he put the ark there. They ministered with music there at the tabernacle until Solomon built the temple of the Lord in Jerusalem. Then they carried on their work there, following all the regulations handed down to them. These are the men who served along with their sons. Heman, the musician, was from the clan of Kohath. His genealogy was traced back through Joel, Samuel, Elkanah, Jeroham, Eliel, Toa, Zuf, Elkanah, Mechath, Amasai, Elkanah, Joel, Azariah, Zephaniah, Tehath, Asir, Abiasaph, Korah, Ishar, Kohath, Levi, and Israel. Heman's first assistant was Asaph from the clan of Gershon. Asaph's genealogy was traced back through Berechiah, Shimeah, Michael, Beasaiah, Malkijah, Ethni, Zira, Adaiah, Ethan, Zima, Shimei, Jehath, Gershon, and Levi. Heman's second assistant was Ethan from the clan of Marari. Ethan's genealogy was traced back through Kishai, Abdai, Maluch, Hashabiah, Amaziah, Hilkiah, Amzai, Banai, Shimer, Malai, Mushai, Marari, and Levi. Their relatives, also Levites, were appointed to various other tasks in the tabernacle, the house of God. Only Aaron and his descendants served as priests. They presented the offerings on the altar of burnt offering and the altar of incense, and they performed all the other duties related to the most holy place. They made atonement for Israel by following all the commands that Moses, the servant of God, had given them. The descendants of Aaron were Eleazar, Phinehas, Abishua, Bukai, Uzai, Serahiah, Merioth, Amariah, Ahitub, Zadok, and Ahimaaz. This is a record of the towns and territory assigned by means of sacred lots to the descendants of Aaron who were from the clan of Kohath. This included Hebron and its surrounding pasture lands in Judah, but the fields and outlying areas were given to Caleb son of Jephunneh. So the descendants of Aaron were given the following towns, each with its surrounding pasture lands, Hebron, a city of refuge, Libna, Jatir, Eshtemoa, Holon, Debir, Ain, Juta, and Beth Shemesh. And from the territory of Benjamin they were given Gibeon, Eba, Alameth, 
and Anathoth, each with its pasture lands. So a total of thirteen towns was given to the descendants of Aaron. The remaining descendants of Kohath received ten towns from the territory of the half-tribe of Manasseh by means of sacred lots. The descendants of Gershon received by sacred lots thirteen towns from the territories of Issachar, Asher, Naphtali, and from the Bashan area of Manasseh east of the Jordan. The descendants of Merari received by sacred lots twelve towns from the territories of Reuben, Gad, and Zebulun. So the people of Israel assigned all these towns and pasture lands to the Levites. The towns in the territories of Judah, Simeon, and Benjamin, mentioned above, were also assigned by means of sacred lots. The descendants of Kohath received from the territory of Ephraim these towns, each with its surrounding pasture lands. Shechem, a city of refuge in the hill country of Ephraim, Gizer, Jokmiam, Bethoron, Aijalon, and Gathrimon. The remaining descendants of Kohath were assigned these towns from the territory of the half-tribe of Manasseh, Aner, and Biliam, each with its pasture lands. The descendants of Gershon received from the territory of the half-tribe of Manasseh the town of Golan in Bashan with its pasture lands, and Ashtaroth with its pasture lands. From the territory of Issachar they were given Kidesh, Debarath, Ramoth, and Anem with their pasture lands. From the territory of Asher they received Mashal, Abdon, Hukok, and Rehob, each with its pasture lands. From the territory of Naphtali they were given Kidesh in Galilee, Hamon, and Kiriathaim, each with its pasture lands. The remaining descendants of Merari received from the territory of Zebulun the towns of Jokneam, Karta, Ramono, and Tabor, each with its pasture lands. From the territory of Reuben, east of the Jordan River, opposite Jericho, they received Bezer, a desert town, Jehaz, Kedemoth, and Mephath, each with its pasture lands. And from the territory of Gad, they received Ramoth and Gilead, Mahanaim, Heshbon, and Jezer, each with its pasture lands.